Hey, what's going on guys? I am back with another video about how Crisp enhances the quality of your online meetings. And this time I'm actually gonna be focusing on an update that Crisp made to distinguish between sounds that are happening in the meeting and sounds that are happening outside the meeting. So we're gonna jump right into it and show you what this update entails. So if you've been in an online meeting, you know that there are certain sounds and haptics and things that happen um, to let you know uh, when somebody joins or leaves or when it's recording. Um, and it used to be that Crisp would eliminate those, but now with this new update, you will actually still be able to hear those sounds that are happening within the meeting. So that's what we're gonna do, and we're gonna jump into that right now using Zoom. All right, y'all, so now I'm in my Zoom meeting and I have the recording started and I'll get back to that in a second. But uh, before I get into the new update from Crisp, I'm going to go over again what Crisp can do for you to remove background noises during your meeting. So right now Crisp is turned off and I have some keys. So I'm just gonna jingle these around while I talk um, so you can hear what it sounds like without Crisp. And then also um, just two quick tests. I got this lacrosse ball to simulate a little somebody knocking on a door, shutting a door, or kids dropping a ball. If you're you know, working from home and you have kids. Um, so those are the two tests without crisp on. And now I'm going to turn on the noise removal. All right, so now we're set for that and bring the keys back and we're jingle around again um, so that you can hear the difference of while I'm talking and the noise being removed from crisp. All right, so that's the keys. And now I will talk while get this ball dropping down here, um, which again, simulating a, a knock on the door or kids. And also uh, just me rolling back and forth on my chair, um, you know, should, should be another little example of that. So that's with Chris turned on. Um, and now I'm going to show you what it looks like with, uh, with the new update of Crisp and what happens within the meetings itself. And to do that, I'm going to uh, log in here on my other account. So give me one second. All right, so I'm about to join in the meeting uh, through my other account, and um, you'll be able to hear the entrance and exit sounds of when I'm doing that. So um, again, this is just to show what happens within the meeting itself and still hearing those sounds. So here we go. And so there we go. There was the little chime that said that my other uh, account has uh, joined and I'm not going to put the audio on because it gets really weird uh, if I if I do that for there. Um, and again, so this is uh, is going to be a little tricky to show that the recording is stopped because then the recording stops and you won't see this anymore. Um, so we're going to cut that and then come back, but just so you can hear uh, what that sounds like. But uh, before I do that, again, if somebody leaves a meeting, um, you will hear that. So there we go, that little little chime. And again, now we're gonna try to stop this meeting. Recording stopped. And it is stopped. And again, Crisp should allow that to uh, to happen so that that doesn't be doesn't get interfered with. Um, and now again, we'll we'll really progress. progress. Shake some keys around so you can hear the difference again of when you know somebody joins in versus background noise. All right, y'all, so that is the showcase of the features of this new Crisp update. And I think it's really cool that they've been able to figure out how to continue to keep the sounds that happen within a meeting while still removing background noise. Um, having those meeting sounds can be super important, um, especially when it comes to recording and not recording, because uh, I think for legal purposes, you, you are supposed to know that, um, at least in some states. Um, and then also just allowing people to see who entered, who exited, um, you know, any chats that might may have been sent. So very, very cool update by Crisp and just another way that they help enhance the quality of your online meetings. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.